is Richie. Hi, Richie. This is Robin from D&D Design. Is now a good time to talk? My name is Richie Choi. From the moment I joined the workforce, there was one goal that I wanted more than anything else. A six-figure salary. And this was pretty characteristic of my 20s. I would set my mind on something until I found success. And we would like to offer you the position. Um, a few things. I was 25 years old when I got that offer. This is the beginning of my story. The part I call human doing. Um, but other than that, welcome to the team. Alright, sounds good. I'll look forward to that follow-up email then. Okay, sounds good. Bye-bye, Richie. Bye-bye. With my wallet now one decimal space larger, I did what any normal person in my situation would do. I bought something I didn't need. I bought a camera. The Sony A7 III. But unlike people that buy things that they don't need, I put mine to use real quick. I started a wedding videography business. One by one, newly engaged couples would approach me and just trust me with documenting these very important days in their lives. And shortly afterwards, I tied the knot with my best friend as well. Hi. <laughs> Miranda and I got to live out our dreams and finally have a place to call our own. And this too was a goal that we've been chasing from the start. I was content with my job as well. I got to exercise my creative side daily on packaging solutions, all while making a salary that I had been chasing since my broke college days. And my business was flourishing as well. I really had nothing that I could complain about. One day a package showed up at our house. Someone sent us a Polaroid camera as a newlywed gift and, you know, we put it to use real quick. I wouldn't be sitting here telling you this story unless some tinge of reality start to set in. Some days became nights at work and other days just weren't the most exciting. At the end of the day, a job was a job and I was naive to the reality that no salary amount would fill the void that is a genuine passion in my career. Shortly afterwards, I ran into bumps in my small business as well. Work-life balance. The grass is always greener on the other side until one day, you find yourself knee-deep in the fields that is the other side. Because from the beginning, it had been a goal of mine to be paid to make my art. Yet, I was naive to the reality that these goals that I set for myself came at a cost. And one night, that reality came to collect. Miranda had booked us a date, and I wasn't going to be able to make it. I was going to be out of town filming another wedding, and she was rightfully upset, and I was disappointed in myself. 
with that, I quickly realized why they said, be careful what you wish for. I would come home from an unfulfilling nine to five just to stare at another screen and edit into the wee hours of the night. And this was it. This is what I wished for. And on the nights where the editing magic just wasn't happening, I'd go look for inspiration. This little part of my story is called human being. If you feel it, 